Hi, I'm Pete Kutzer from the Orvis Fly Fishing Schools, and today I'm at Hawk Lake Lodge. We've been chasing after pike and large toothy critters, and when we're using large streamers, such as this right here, it's nice to use a loop knot so we can get a little more action out of our flies. So the knot I'm going to use to attach this fly, this loop knot, I'm going to use a perfection loop. The perfection loop is a great knot it's in line and it works well to get a lot of action out of your flies, but I typically only use this knot with heavy shock tippet or wire bite guard. To tie this knot, I'm going to take my heavy bite guard and I'm going to thread it through the eye of the hook. Once I go through the eye of the hook, I'm then going to tie this perfection loop just like I normally would by creating a loop. That loop in my situation is going to go to my left, my tag end out here to my right. I then take my tag end and I'm going to go around the loop, creating a second loop right here around my thumb. I then take my tag end and I go in between those two loops. I used to say, put the hot dog in the bun. The next step is to open this loop just by pulling on the right side. I can then take my hook and drop it through that loop. I can make that loop a little bit smaller by pulling on the left side of that large loop. And now I'm going to draw it tight. To draw it tight, I just grab the tag in, pull it down, that shrinks the loop. I can pop my fly through, and now I can tighten. Now I snip off my tag end, and I'm ready to go target toothy critters with a fly that's going to dance in the water.